President Pakane has embarked on a historic trip to Africa. First stop, Ethiopia, where Seoul will unveil a new aid project and a new vision for the continent. Our Song ji is traveling with the president, and she filed this report before taking off. President Ba's departure Wednesday coincides with Africa Day, an annual commemoration that celebrates the unity of the continent. Covering the three biggest economies in East Africa, President Ba seeks to strengthen economic and development partnership with the continent, considered the last blue ocean in the world with growth of 5 percent in the 21st century. Seoul will assist Africa with customized development programs while sharing its experience for mutual growth. President Buck will further elaborate on our new vision for Africa on Friday in a speech at the Africa Union headquarters in Addis Ababa, making her the first Korean leader to address the continent. In addition to our diplomacy and official development assistance, Seoul will lay out its vision for Africa in peace and security, mutual growth through economic cooperation, new development models, as well as cultural exchanges. Seoul is set to unveil its Korea aid project in Ethiopia, an official development assistance program on wheels offering health care and cultural contents. Spreading Hailu or the Korean wave across the African continent, the Korea 8 vehicles will show videos ranging from Taekwondo to K-pop and introduce the 2018 Winter Olympic Games in Pyeongchang. Before President Park leads for Uganda and Kenya, a business forum will also be held to help our delegation discover the great potential of Ethiopia. Song Ji-sang, Arirang News.